We're at the zoo. We're at the zoo. We're doing the night safari here in Singapore. That's all we know. That's all we know. That's all we know. It's just you go to the zoo at night. That's all we know. Yeah. <laughs> There's a tram ride, so it makes me think it's a lot like the safari park in California. I think the point is just that we get to see nocturnal animals. So, uh, I'm excited about that. It's exciting. Yeah. All right. All right. Let's go. Let's go. Yep. Yeah. Yeah, but I guess come early. Yeah. What is this line? Tram station. Oh, tram. Oh, do we just immediately get on the tram? I think the line starts over there. Yeah. Yeah, let's just do it. height of five feet or one and a half meters. You might not see the Asian swan clawed otters on the land, but you will definitely smell them. They're related to skunks and other animals that give off strong scents to mark their territory. Otters are agile swimmers with webbed toes and streamlined bodies. You'll often find them hunting fish and small shellfish or just splashing around and having fun. The lion is the national animal of Singapore. You'll see images of lions everywhere, including a merlion with a lion's head and the body of a fish. Born and raised here at the Night Safari, his name is Sangvira, a term that means warrior in the Malay language. I've seen wild sandbar deer in India, Sri Lanka, Nepal, and China. This brought the tigers into closer contact with humans. Who Our camera died on yeah. the tram ride, so we are now filming on the phone. What do you think? Tram ride was good. I thought it was really cool. I mean, I literally have no idea what to expect, so. Yeah. That was pretty cool. They just drive you around. There are some areas where you go into and there's no fence. Yeah. So the animals just like free roam. And some of them are like right there outside of the tram. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, but we have to see a tapir up close. Yeah, super cool. But They're actually closer to the rhinoceros family than they are to the pig or elephant family. The more you know. Correctly. The more you know. But now we're just going to do the walking trail. So they have some like that you're designed just for walking, I guess, and maybe a different view than what you get on the trip. So we're going to do that. Let's go. Hello. Bye-bye. dinner and this is what we've got. Brown sugar bubble cheese, I'm excited. Yeah, I think you'll like it. Oh, right. 
I'm scared. Free flying fruit bat room. Watch the urine. Oh. oh. They're on the sea. Yeah. No, don't call them over. Oh, there's one in the tree here. Okay, are you ready to go? Yep. I think I'm ready to go. All right. Big one. like 11 o'clock. We're just at the zoo. So we've got 45 minutes to the rest of this Wallaby Trail. And the East Lodge Trail. And the East Lodge Trail. So we can make it back to the shop before it closes. Yes. Wow, we're sweaty. Whoa. It's I cannot see. I know that. we can't see. It's like 11 20. So it's kinda late. The park closes at midnight. We just made it through everything at the park, so we're just trying to head out to the exit now so we can go to the shop. But it's kind of quiet now. It's not that many people. It's scary. Did go shopping. Ended up picking up this bag with a hand-drawn pangolin on it. And now we're heading out. Yep. Heading grab out. a grab a grab. Grab a grab. <laughs> 